call me. It's a Japanese word for making things out of folded paper. Neat. What else can you make? Hmm. Oh, I know. Tell me when you know what it is. It's a bird. Bingo. I want to do this. Can I please have some paper? Well, of course. Where are you going? To my room to practice. Do you want some help? Origami can be a little tricky. Nah, I can figure it out. It's a house. A boat. A houseboat. It's supposed to be an elephant. Oh. Maybe you could ask Nana for help. Yeah, Nana knows how to do everything. But I want to give it to her as a present. It's not a surprise if she helps. If I saw a finished one, I bet I could figure it out. Now, where are you going to find an origami elephant? In Dino World. Hey, oh, great idea. Great idea. Great idea. Let's go. I didn't sneeze, Terence. Bonsai is what you call those tiny trees. I love Japanese stuff. They invented my favorite sport, you know, sumo wrestling. Never heard of it. But never heard of sumo wrestling? Well, you don't know what you're missing. I'll give you a demonstration. Oh, Tori, what are you doing in the Zen garden? Making a wrestling ring. As long as you put it back the way it was. Hey, Stiggy, want to be a sumo wrestler? Me? Okay. Okay, now do what I do. Now, when Harry says go, try to push me out of the ring. Ready? One, two, three, go! Oh, oh, no! <laughs> Tori, are you okay? Tickling is against the rules. Well, nobody told me. Hey, if tiny real trees are called bonsai, what are paper ones called? Origami! a paper bird. And a paper house. And a paper butterfly. I don't see any paper elephants. Interesting. Everything appears to be burned around the edges. Why? Who would want to burn it? But whoever it is, he's not very good at flying kites. I'll get it down. <laughs> ground. I'll never leave it again. <laughs> oh, thank you for saving me. My pleasure. 
My name is Tatsu. Welcome to my home. Your village is great, Tatsu. Especially the origami. You like it? I have many more. Please come and see. Wow! You're an origami expert. Can you show me how to make an elephant? It's for my Nana. I can try. <laughs> I can't see what you're doing. Wow! Hey, what you do that for? I am sorry. I could not hold my breath any longer. Why were you holding your breath? Because I breathe fire every time I open my mouth. So that's why everything is burned. Yes, I cannot help it. All I ever wanted was to make beautiful origami, but everything I make gets ruined. That's terrible. Is there any way we can help? Thank you, my friend. But I do not think anyone can help me. If only there were a way to put my fire out. Maybe there is. But how? When I had candles on my birthday cake, I blew them out. Maybe we can blow out your fire. By my calculations, it would take a very strong wind. We'll use a fan, like Nana had. Do you know how to make a fan, Tatsu? Yes, but if I make it, it will have the same fate as your elephant. But if you tell us what to do, we can make the fan. Yeah, we, we, can can we, can we can do this. Steggy, bring your corner to Tori and crease. Sit, fold under, then over. Patsy's corner into Steggy's fold. Harry, fold the straight edge under. Trike, flip over. Tori's tab into Sid's fold. Then crease it one last time. We did it! Very impressive. Magnificent. But will it work? There's only one way to find out. Wow! Look at her go! It's blowing itself away! You can't see it! Time for Who says my 
my dinosaurs aren't cool. Hey, who says we're not cool? Um, uh, yeah, who? We're as cool as a cucumber in a cumberbund. Yeah, yeah who? He does. <laughs> Colin Carlisle? Colin is pretty cool. The coolest? Isn't that what you said, Harry? Yeah, but in this backpack is the coolest dinosaur you've ever seen. Can we see your dinosaur, Colin? Well, I was saving it for show and tell this afternoon. What? He can't. I brought my dinosaurs for show and tell. But if you beg me... <gasps> Raging Rex 5000, the coolest, most powerful, most dangerous Dinobot on Earth. Wow! Wow! Come on, it's just a robot, a bag of nuts and bolts. Tell him, Harry, go on! Did you see those flashing red eyes? And electric blue fangs. Hey, I got fangs. It is. Tori, Raging Rex is a titanium action transformer with integrated circuitry and extra chomping power. The uh, extra ch ch chomping power? So? Tell them what we're made of, Sid. Um, plastic. We're made of plastic. Reinforced plastic. Look, I just flipped the switch. See? Stomps. It jumps and turns the world to rubble. And it's 100% indestructible. Wow. It does everything all by itself. <laughs> what do your dinosaurs do, Harry? Uh, my dinosaurs? Nothing. <laughs> what? They don't do anything. Okay, that's it. Let me at him, let me at him. I'll take that bucket of bolts. <laughs> later. I'll, I'll get them later. What am I gonna do about show and tell? Why, you'll show us, of course. Colin will laugh at me. Then all the other kids will laugh. I need a plan. Where can I get a really fantastic dinosaur before lunch is over? Well, there's always Dino... Oh. Of course, Dino World! I'll build my own dinosaur! Yeah, but what about us? You can help me. It'll be fun. Ready, guys? most powerful Dinobot on Earth. Wait till you see my creation, guys. It's gonna be super cool. Big deal. Steggy, hand me the optical orbital illuminators. Uh, what are optical uh, orbital balloonimators, huh? Eyes, Steggy, just a pair of eyes. Harry likes his new dinosaur so much, he doesn't want to play with us anymore. It's a possibility. Don't worry, Steggy. There's no way Harry would like that hunk of junk better than us. If... if it doesn't work. Hey, Tori, I need the bicycle gears. You mean the... this bicycle? Huh. Seems to have been in a little accident. Oh, yeah, it sure is a shame. Gee, I wonder how that happened. Oh, I know. Tori broke it. Oh. Gee, then that means I'll have to... Skip the hydraulic pistons and go for integrated circuitry. Huh? Okay, I'm ready to power it up. I just need that extra heavy-duty supercharged battery. I won't help him make that thing. I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't. 
Oh, I guess this one's a little flat, hmm? Gee, without a battery, I have no way to store energy to power my robot. Oh, that's too bad. That's, that's terrible. terrible. Yeah. Right. Unless I use solar power. Oh. Now that he's charged up, it's time to throw the switch. Matters. I bet he can't roar nearly as loud as me. Not bad. But he's so big, Harry, you'll never get him out of the cave. Oh, yeah? Did it, Sid? Uh, 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 maybe just a little. I 
wish I was a builder. I want to wear a hard hat and put stuff together and build buildings. Oh, that's wonderful, Harry. What kind of building do you want to build? A really big building, a million stories high, with a super big toy store on the roof. And swings <laughs> and slides and a pizza parlor on every floor. A million stories? <laughs> well, you better get started. Hey, what's all the racket? Sounds like a raccoon in a rumpus room. I'm gonna be a builder. Hey, that sounds like fun. It's going to be the greatest, coolest, biggest building ever. Hmm, greatest, coolest, and biggest. You're going to need a lot more blocks. You're right. Hmm, I don't think my room's going to be big enough. But you still got to build, huh, Harry? Where? Somewhere big and wide and open and, uh, big. Yeah, some place where the sky's the limit. Hey, let's go build in... Dino World! Everything is big in Dino World. Even I'm big in Dino World. Well, what are we waiting for? with lots of lights and uh, uh, flashy signs and, and... No, no, no. A big castle surrounded by a river of chocolate. <laughs> and a place with plenty of headroom. And big, thick books on the shelves all about dinosaurs. Wait a minute. Everybody wants something different. I know. Maybe we should each build our own building. Yeah, we've got lots of stuff. Let's build lots of buildings. Excellent. Now, first, we draft precise plans and... Plans? I say less talk, more blocks. Let the building begin. Only a million more stories to go. Mine's going to be a, a two million stories. Well, mine's going to be a gazillion stories. I don't think 
I'm cut out for building things. This is gonna be the most humongous building ever. Oh yeah? Well, it won't be as shiny as mine. Look at this puppy. Yes, but neither of you have statues like mine. Oh, would you look at that? Mine will have way more style. Hey, hey, hey! can't even see my lights. Oops, is, is that you, Patsy? Oh, try it. You're standing on my foot. Oh, no. We built so much we can't even see the sun. I guess we just got carried away. Oh, hello? I, is anybody there? Steggy, is that you? Harry? <laughs> Ooh, what was that? Whoa! <laughs> I can't do anything right. But my tail keeps hitting stuff. No, that's just great, Steggy. Do it again. What? Uh, are you sure? Oh, <laughs> well, um, <laughs> okay. Here goes. <laughs> Team, let's go. Guys, oh, yeah, we're all back to normal. <laughs> Boy, that was fun, huh? You know, next time I'm having brighter lights. Oh, yeah, and I'm definitely having bigger statues. And I really must try that purple wallpaper, and definitely more chocolate sauce. And when you need a demolition dino to knock it all down again, give me a call. You bet your steak, Harry. It's mom. We better go home. Lead the way, Harry! Hi, Harry. There you are. How's your big building coming along? Just great, Mom. It was so big it covered the sun. Wow, that's pretty big. Hey, would you like to help me fold some laundry? Sure, Mom. After this, the dinosaurs and I are going to build one even bigger. As high as the moon. Now that is high. <laughs> Hey, maybe with these we could even build the biggest tent in Dino World. Yeah! Can I sleep in my tent? But Harry, things are looking a little 
soggy outside. I think you're better off camping in the wilds of your nice, dry bedroom. Marshmallow, because we're in a pretend camp. Well, that's no fun. Yeah, if only we could go play in a real camp. But one that's nice and dry. And full of trees. With a lot of places to hike. And lots of fun things to do. Dino World! Right on the ground? No, you guys have hammocks, and I get to sleep in my real tent. Somebody serve it up. Now we'll have to pick our own dinner. Wow. But how can we tell what's safe to eat? I'll bet these are safe. Mmm, the peanut butter and jelly. My favorite. Oh, and look what we have for dessert. Wow, chocolate chip. My favorite. <laughs> Yeah, but the old man was just too curious. So he left the campsite to see what was making the strange noise. And there, deep in the darkness, he found a big, creepy monster. And it roared at them. What did it sound like? Oh! <laughs> Stop it, Tori. You're scaring Steggy. Um, that wasn't me. Find out what's out there. Now who's with me? Guys? No, we were just uh, 
looking for the, uh, oh, uh, the flashlight. Something is in my den. Is it the monster? No. Phew. For a moment, I was worried there. It's a bear! <laughs> Are we going to sleep tonight? Well, I guess if the bear's got our tent, we could sleep in his house. I think you'll find the bears live in caves. Terrence is right. We'll sleep in the bear's cave. Yeah, good that's idea. Good. That's good. Okay. Now everybody look for signs of a bear cave nearby. <laughs> Could spot. That looks like a bear, all right. Good work, Tori. Look, there's lots of them. Hey, look, it's the bear's cave. Wow, this place has more leaks than a leprechaun in a library. No wonder the bear didn't want to sleep in here. Well, we can't sleep here either. Sure, we can. We just have to fix the leaks. We all deserve prizes for leak plugging. Look, the rain stopped. And it's daytime already. <laughs> I stayed up all night long. Uh oh. Hi, Mr. Bear. I hope you don't mind, but we spent the night here and we fixed the leaks in your roof. some good strawberries. Wow, Mr. Bear sure knows all the best places to look for them. Ha! Ah, time for my mid-morning nap. Ow. I gotta lay off those marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> Mom's home! Bye, Mr. Bear! Thanks for all your help! terrifying sound. Oh. What was it, Tori? It was a squishy sound. Squish, squish. <gasps> it's right outside the tent. Oh. Nana! Harry, you're as white as a sheet. We thought you were a monster. Would a monster bring you a nice hot cup of cocoa? Marshmallows. I spy. Something big and blue. Uh, the sky? 
Yes! I spy a Tyranno... No, a Tyraptor. I can't remember Trike's proper name. Triceratops. Oh, yeah. Triceratops. And you're a... I'm a Skeletosaurus, and Terrans is a Pterodactyl. It's really hard to remember how to say all your proper names. Oh, uh, that's okay. Uh, well, we forget them, too. But you're my friends. I gotta remember your names. Let's ask Nana for help. Hey, Nana! I can't remember how to say any of the proper dinosaur names. Oh, I used to have trouble with that, too. But you know what I did? What? I made up a song to help me out. Sing it, please. Oh, I can try. Now, let's see. Um, trike is a... Uh, uh, oh, hmm. That's strange. The song's gone. A song can't just disappear. Well, this one has. Oh, I hope I haven't lost it. Sorry, Harry. We've got to find that song for Nana. Oh, yes, 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 absolutely. absolutely. But where do we look? It's a song about dinosaurs. So the place to look must be Dino World. Great idea! Oh, yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. for a song that Nana used to sing to help her remember the dinosaur names. Our names can be very difficult. I think I can help. You do? Follow me, dudes. What's all this? Songs. Every song ever written, sung, or whistled is in this warehouse. So Nana's song must be here. Where do we start? Well, Nana's song is in a box. Great. Which one? The problem is I, I don't exactly know. I haven't, well, had time to, you know, tidy this place up. Boy, so how do you ever find anything? I just sort of feel for the vibe of what I'm looking for. But this is impossible. It would take days to go through all this. Years. Definitely years. Well, we'll never find it if we just stand here. Uh, any clues about what we're looking for? The box has Nana's picture on it. Just look and you'll find it. All right, everyone. Start looking. Open it up, Harry. Oh, no! It's empty. The pieces of the song must have gone. But they must be here somewhere. If we're quiet, we might hear them. Name me the name of the dinosaurs. Name me the name of the dinosaurs. Look, it's Nana! Name me the name of the dinosaurs. Ooh. But she's smaller than a seahorse in a soup spoon. It's just a little model of her. This must be part of the song. Name 
name be the name of the dinosaurs. But is it broken? No! You need to find all the pieces of the song for it to work. It's like a song puzzle. So, uh, what do they look like? I'm not sure. Nana's piece of the song looks just like her. And sounds like her, too. So if the song is all about dinos, then each of the pieces must look and sound just like one of you. Once we collect them all, we'll have Nana's song. A patasaurus, too. A patasaurus, too. A patasaurus, too. A patasaurus, too. <laughs> A patasaurus, too. A patasaurus, too. Name me the name of the dinosaurs. A patasaurus, too. Wow. Now let's find the others. Tops, Tyrannosaurus, woo! This is how I say their names. It isn't hard to do. Remembering is fun in games, and you can do it too. Yay! Yay! See? You remembered all the dinosaurs' names. And I'll never, ever forget them again. <laughs> 